Although it's disappointing that COVID-19 restrictions have put paid to our brownie groups, combined Halloween and bonfire night celebrations together this year. Although, after last year's debacle, that might not be such a bad thing at all. My, what an experience that was. It began when I was the most senior sixer. I suggested to Brown Owl that after years and years of Americana, we took back control. Hadn't we had enough of orange pumpkin heads? No, I'm not on about him. Although, now you mention it. Anyway, where was I? Oh yes, that's it. A return to traditional values. Brown Owl asked me if I was suggesting a pagan festival and muttered something about wicker baskets. I hadn't a clue what she was going on about and I'm not sure if she did either. I thought the only basket case around here is. But I said no. Nothing as sinister as that. I thought something maybe more fun like bobbing apples. You could tell all the girls were keen. But there's always one who's a little too eager, isn't there? Yes, Greedy Karen couldn't wait to get started. She stuck her head in straight away and we were all chanted merrily as she flared it around trying to catch an apple, we thought. It was only when her body went suddenly quite limp but I thought she may in fact be drowning. Fortunately, as the most badged brownie in my group, I was able to resuscitate her. She still didn't look quite right though. So Brown Owl decided to call an ambulance and that's when the trouble really started. No sooner had it arrived than the man from the health and safety executive turned up as well. He was not happy with the lack of risk assessments going on around here and demanded to know who was in charge. With title goes responsibility. So I pointed him in the direction of the departing brown owl, who I suggested was making an escape in an ambulance. And that's when the celebrations ended. We haven't seen brown owl since because her tag doesn't allow her out in the evenings. So I've been running our weekly meetings. This year, given the constraints, We've been running some socially distant fundraising for our pound for the guy. Well, come on, there is inflation after all. And for those who don't want to support us, I brought back a traditional game. Knock down Ginger. And no, I'm still not on about him.